Gunner had originally been stolen. Um, Gunner's owner is a truck driver traveling from state to state all over the place and um, he Gunner was just stolen out of his truck one evening. A uh, window was shattered and Gunner was gone. We have taken stray animals every single day. Um, a concerned couple from Dunbar actually brought Gunner into us. Um, and part of our intake protocol is to scan every single animal for a microchip. Um, and upon scanning Gunner, we found out that he did have one. Uh, we were able to enter in his microchip number to the national microchip database and from there we were able to get his owner's contact information which is when we found out that um, his owner lived in what we thought was ohio that's what his microchip said um, so we gave his owner a call and said you know hey we found your dog uh, if you'd like to come grab him and his owner informed us that he had recently relocated to savannah georgia he didn't have means to get up to charleston to get his dog uh, so that's kind of what started Gunner's story here. Um, well, I saw, I follow the Kanawha County uh, Humane Society and I call, you know, I follow Pig Pig. And um, I'm from here, so I was going to be up here for a wedding anyhow. And I saw where the pup, his owner, is now in Savannah. Um, and he's been missing for two years. Which actually I didn't know that to begin with. I just knew his owner was in Savannah. And I was like, well, I'm gonna be in Charleston. I have to go home to Savannah. I might as well give him a ride, you know? Because if I know if it was my dog, I would want somebody to bring him home to me. I'm just excited to get him home to his, his dog dad. Oh my God. How you doing? Oh. Huh? Didn't give up hope. Like we went like probably a year just searching and searching and nothing. But he's coming back. So I always tell people just don't give up hope because you never know what's gonna happen. <laughs> 